About a year ago, I made a video called 10 Best Uses of Nutella and you guys absolutely loved it and the video's got like nearly a million views, which is mind-blowing. What is the second most delicious thing in the entire world? Peanut butter. This video took me so long to film, but I'm so proud of it because the recipes on this are just the best ever. And before we get into the actual video, Nationwide invited me on their Money Stuff channel. I basically shared this story that I've never actually told you guys before, which is how did I get into cooking? It's kind of a backstory of my childhood. It's oddly personal. So if you want to watch this video, you can click here or there's also a link in the description down below. I'm also going to link it at the end of the video. So please go and check it out. It's kind of a funny story. I think you guys are going to like it. Let's start with a whole jar of peanut butter. 260 grams of white sugar and one egg. Combine all the ingredients in a bowl. Bake it at 180 degrees for about 12 minutes. And there you go, super simple and super delicious. You will need peanut butter, icing sugar, your favorite chocolate, and some paper cases. Melt the chocolate in the microwave and fill it up to about one third. Let it sit in the fridge and meanwhile combine peanut butter with icing sugar. Press the mixture on the chocolate cups and cover it up with the remaining chocolate and there you go. To make the hot chocolate, you'll need some peanut butter, any kind of milk, and your favorite chocolate. Heat up the chocolate and milk, then when you're happy with the look of it, just finish it off with a spoon of peanut butter for extra tastiness. You will need some peanut butter, any kind of your favorite nuts, quick oats, honey, cinnamon, and chocolate chips. Combine all the ingredients in a bowl. If it's too dry, just add some more honey or peanut butter, and there you go. The perfect and quick snack. Start by picking your favorite fruit, then cut it into slices. On a separate bowl, mix Greek yogurt and peanut butter. You can add honey for extra sweetness. And there you go, a healthy and delicious way to eat fruit. For this recipe, you will need a jar of peanut butter and your favorite cream cookies. Remove all the icing from the middle of the cookies and then add two small spoons of peanut butter. And voila! Special edition peanut butter cream cookies. For this recipe you'll need tortilla wraps, peanut butter and also your favorite jam, and one banana. On one half I'm doing jam and fruit, and on the other one peanut butter and chocolate chips. This is perfect as a replacement for a peanut butter jelly sandwich. For this recipe, you will need peanut butter, chocolate chips, marshmallows, and your favorite cereal. Microwave the peanut butter and marshmallows for 30 seconds. Mix all the ingredients and flatten it down with a mug. Let it sit for a while and then just cut into it. And there you go, your homemade cereal bars. For this recipe, you will need some already popped corn, peanut butter, and white chocolate. Melt the white chocolate and peanut butter in the microwave. Now coat your popcorn with the mixture. You can enjoy it warm, or you can wait for it to get crunchy. For this recipe, you will need one banana, peanut butter, and a Ziploc freezing bag. Cut the banana and put it in the freezer. Grab the frozen slices and blend them with a small spoon of peanut butter for flavor. And there you go, a super creamy ice cream. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also let me know what do you think would be like an amazing recipe to do with 10 best uses of? Maybe 10 best uses of rainbows. <laughs> what I mean is rainbow recipes. Leave a comment down below and let me know what do you want me to do 10 best uses of on the next episode of this series. I'm gonna go and I'll see you in a few days. You know, the usual. Alright, <laughs> I'm such a loser. Bye!